The family of a Perth woman who suffers a debilitating illness fears she doesn't have long to live. With Theda Mint's chronic condition baffling doctors in Australia, it's believed her last hope now lies overseas. Ten years ago, Theda Mint was an outgoing and energetic young woman about to embark on a career in investigative journalism. But after catching the flu in the UK, the performing arts graduate's life started to unravel as a mystery illness took hold. She couldn't understand why she was so tired all the time. And then the doctors all said, oh, there's nothing wrong with you, it's psychiatric, you're depressed. Three and a half years later, Theta was diagnosed with chronic fatigue syndrome. Since then, no one has been able to find a cause or treatment for her illness. The 34-year-old is now bedridden in a darkened room. Not being able to think properly or watch television or read books or even go out of the house, be part of the world, that's really hard. More than all the other painful physical symptoms. Her mother Carol fears Theta's body may one day shut down. Theta has even spoken about ending her life. I don't think there's a morning goes by when I don't take a breath when I go into her bedroom and hope she's still alive and try to prepare myself for the fact that she might not be, because I can't imagine my life without my daughter. Researchers say the illness, which has long been sidelined as a psychological disorder, is notoriously difficult to treat and is not just a simple case of feeling tired. We just don't know what causes it, so we can't fix it. Everyone involved is, is um, frustrated by this disorder. While we persist with this very vague, very broad definition which is centred on fatigue, I don't think we're going to make any useful steps forward in medical understanding. Theda's friends have started fundraising for testing in the UK and Belgium that may narrow down what is causing her illness and help find a successful treatment. Dougal Wallace, 10 News.